the melt capabilities that we have here at ATI take several forms. They build on one another. When you look at them in and of themselves, just a person off the street, an immense amount of power. So in order to start a melt, we're going to formulate based off of what the customer specifications requirements are. So that entails sourcing the raw materials and we're buying pure elements such as nickel and cobalt, titanium, and we mix all of that together to make various nickel-based super alloys and titanium alloys that are used in jet engine applications as well as many biomedical applications. We're basically making a cake. When we're going to make that cake, we're going to put all the ingredients in and we can taste it and make additions to it before we actually bake it. Once we put it into the molds, that cake is not quite ready yet. Some things we need to do to it. Each of the steps is a refining step. That just really helps to, to solidify it so that there's no voids. That aspect of it is fascinating in the metallurgy, figuring out what atoms we need and where they need to be. And we work with about half the periodic table on a regular basis. So we're gonna add some ice into it, let's say. So we're gonna melt it again and start to make the properties that the customer has ordered in order to meet those final properties downstream. And then you can, you can go on to the hot work and really form it into the shape of the product that the customer needs. No one melt is the same. Different raw materials going in each time can, can create a lot of challenges. Whether it's the jet engines, the number of takeoff and landing cycles that an engine can perform safely, or the biomedical applications. We are developing new methods of manufacture, new ways to make some unique products and provide value to other companies and to society at, at large. The, the sheer power, whether that's a press moving hot material or a furnace where we're melting it, to be able to control that power to a really fine degree to be able to produce the products that we do, that's fascinating to me. It's a great sense of satisfaction to be able to deliver the quality and know that the customers are counting on us. Anybody can go buy the equipment that we have out there. They can't buy our processes, they can't buy our controls. We've developed these processes and controls over the years. We've built them in-house. We think that sets us apart from our competitors and allows us to make the best metal in the world.